People asking questions. How to avoid distractions and focus better? Hi, my name is Mirek Kanik from Head Office Health. We are family and couples oriented and mental health clinic. We thank you for your support. And if you like these videos, please subscribe. How to conquer distractions and foster focus. Here are some strategies that might help you find your center and boost your productivity. Firstly, let's acknowledge that distractions are part of life. By managing them is where our power lies. The key is to create an environment that encourages focus. Begin by decluttering your physical space. A tidy space often translates to a clear mind. Remove unnecessary items, organize your workspace, and let the energy flow freely. Now, let's talk about the digital realm. Our devices can be both a blessing and a curse. When it comes to focus, consider setting specific times for checking emails and social media. Switch off your notifications. Phone can wait. Your dreams cannot. So speaking of deep work, break it down your task into manageable chunks. Set realistic goals and prioritize them. This is not only helps you um, stay on track, but also gives you a sense of accomplishment as you check it each of the tasks ah, and an art of mindfulness. It's a game changer. Incorporate short breaks for meditation, breathing exercises or a quick stretch. Connect with your breath, focus on your heart, place your hand on your heart space and breathe into your heart with gratitude. Feel the sensation in your body as your chest is rising and falling with every breath you take and let go of that mental clutter. This helps reset your mind and enhances your ability to concentrate. For example, imagine you are knee deep in a demanding project. Take five minutes to step away from your desk, find a quiet spot and engage in a quick mindfulness exercise. Focus on your breath. Inhale deeply, letting go of any tensions. When you return to your desk, you'll find a renewed sense of focus and clarity. Now let's not forget about the importance of fueling your body and mind. Stay hydrated, nourish yourself with wholesome foods and take plenty of rest. A well-nourished body and mind are better equipped to tackle challenges and resist, yes, distractions. Lastly, don't be too hard on yourself. Rome wasn't built in a day and neither is a perfect focus achieved overnight. Celebrate your victories no matter how small and learn from any setbacks. Progress, not perfection, is the ultimate goal. So remember, you are dancing to a rhythm. Finding what rhythm works best for you may take some experimentation. So embrace the process, stay positive, and believe in your ability to cultivate and focus and be productive through your mindset. You've got this. So talk to your partner. I know you can do this. Try it.